Here's another little update. Um, it's been a few days since my last video. I've worked pretty tirelessly on building this uh, quarter inch aluminum plate. Um, I essentially just cut it to, uh, to the generic shape of the outside of the, the lower plenum here and then used a uh, you know a die grinder with some uh, carbon steel rasps to actually just grind out the material and I also used a hole saw to try to take the majority of the material out of those ports um, and then um, you know use a rasp to clean it up and then used a, a sanding wheel to clean the rest up and a, then I used one of these roll lock discs to clean the rest of the material somehow this aluminum I bought it as a scrap piece it was like perfectly flat and pretty much perfect but it had some kind of coating on it and it wasn't aluminum oxide it was literally some kind of coating on it um, I had to grind it completely off uh, I wish I would have noticed that when I bought the piece of aluminum um, but you know that's what happens when you buy scrap so um, but it, it, it turned out pretty good and I'm about to weld it to the lower plenum I've already placed it um, Unfortunately, I am going to have to take the take the intake off if I want to clear this. If I want to be able to unplug this solenoid right here, so if I want to be able to unplug the VVTI valve uh, for this this bank, um, I am going to have to uh, I'm going to have to pull the intake off to do that. Um, but it, it has about uh, maybe about that much clearance when it's installed, so. Uh, it looks pretty good. The the quarter inch plate raised it up enough to where it'll actually clear the lower plenum. So, or I mean the the fuel rails. So it'll it'll actually clear the fuel rails now. And I got about an eighth inch, maybe a little bit more than an eighth inch between the fuel rail and the bottom of the uh, the intake manifold. So. I'm gonna get to welding. Uh, I'm just gonna throw a couple tacks on it and then uh, finish welding it the rest of the way. That's just a little update for now.